What's up YouTube? Do you feel like you're here? Bringing you another Pokemon TCG opening. Today's opening is going to be the Zygarde Collection. The newest set that I could find that we haven't opened on the channel. I've been meaning to get the uh, Generations, the Trainer Box set. I haven't yet to find it, but when I do, I will be opening that on the channel. Um, and the new uh, set, Steam Siege, is coming out, so maybe I'll do an opening for that. I've been debating on getting a booster box, so maybe, maybe I will do that on the channel. I will see. I don't know how much of how I feel about spending the money to buy a full booster box. I, I'm tempted, but we'll see. But let's jump on into this set, which got four packs in here, so we should have some, hopefully get some good stuff out of here. Leave your thumbs up down below, hopefully we get some cool stuff out of here. Alright guys, we're on this camera now. But we, as you can see, you got the four sets in here. It looks like uh, two fates collide, and then a break point and a breakthrough, and then obviously you get this really cool Zygarde figure. I like the figures too. I definitely have a thing. I don't know. I like I like the little collectibles that come in all these collections. They're just you know they're just another little thing to tempt you. I mean these ones aren't too bad of a price for what you get for these for the packs and everything. And of course, obviously you know first off, yeah, you get the. Uh, let me uh, move this out of the way real quick so let me focus on this. If it would focus. There we go. You get this really cool Zygarde uh, card. So it's got Rumble and Geostrike. So the defending Pokemon can retreat during your net opponent's next turn. That, that's kind of useful. And then Geostrike. This tag does 10 damage to each, your, each of your benched Pokemon. So that's, eh, that's okay, that's not great. I mean, it's, it's a pretty decent attack, but I don't know if it's really worth the trade-off. Like, that's 120 is not really worth that trade-off to me. But, put that aside. And then the other thing that you do get, oh geez, which is the uh, the Zygarde figure, which is cool. I, I really do like this thing. I, li I like this perfect Zygarde form. I'm really excited to see what he what turns out uh, comes out of him in Sun and Moon. I, lo I think... He has a, a, oh, he has to have a stand or something here too somewhere, because there's no way he stands on his own. But he's pretty pretty cool. But what we're really here for? Oh, and it does come with a uh, it does come with a code card for I'm assuming the Zygarde and certain things. And these always always sets come with that for the TCGO. Oh, there's a little. Oh, I thought this was a coin in the thing, but this is the, he does come with a little stand. But put all that aside. But we do have that was loud. So we do have. Two fates collide and then a break point and a breakthrough. So we'll start with actually, you know what? We'll start with the fates collide and then go through the two breaks. So first up is this really cool fates collide pack. Let's see what we can claw out of this thing. So obviously, ah, yeah, damn. I hate like they never put the code cards in the same position. So obviously, one, two, three to the front. And let's see what we got in these packs. We haven't had too much good luck with uh, Fates Collide yet, so hopefully we get some a good card out of the set. Uh, so you got Ultra Ball, Shauna, always kind of staples at this point. Uh, Servine, ooh, I, for, I always forget Superiors in this set. I really do like the Superior in this set. Um, Snivy, ha, ironic. Solosis, Fennekin, Wismer, Seal, Reverse Hollow Riolu, and Reuniclus is our rare. Well, once again, Fates Collide has kind of failed us. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Still have not gotten anything that I'm really psyched for this. So now, breakthrough. Mega Houndoom is in this set. The EX is, that, would, that would be kind of a cool card to get. Um, put the code card aside. One, two, three. To the front. And... Printlup. Ooh, I didn't realize Napoleon's on this set. That's pretty cool. So, Printlup got Ice Beam, too. Uh, revert, reserve Ticket. Flip a coin if head search your deck for a card, shuffle then. Oh, okay, that's, that's pretty good. Uh, Floet. Oh, that's nice. Starly. Swinub. Inke. Axew. Ooh, Dragon types. Woobat. The reverse is Heavy Boots. Interesting. And the rare in the pack is Star Raptor. A really cool card art though. Is that over? What shit is that? I can't really tell what city that is. If that's supposed to be a certain city, I don't remember a big building in the middle of water in any of the Pokemon games like that in like one of the main uh, things. So so far, no hollows or anything out of this set. It's hopefully one of these two packs we pull something cool out. So next is Breakpoint. I didn't really show the pack, but so be it. So look, this one now. This one has the code card facing. The direction, so if you do it that way, that's I don't get it. Uh, one, two, three, to the front, 
And, ooh, a max potion. That's pretty good. So let's see, you got max potion. Lapras, ooh, that's cool. I haven't seen a lot. I wish, have they had a Lapras EX? I think I've said that before too. Frogadier, that art's always just so cool. Glamew, Glamow, Meow, whatever. Phantom, Psyduck, Clefairy, Slowpoke, with a little duck lid in the shelter. <laughs> ooh, reverse Hell of Fairies. Dude, all. Uh, steel type reverses are kind of cool. And the. Oh, and then the rare in the pack is a Ho Ho EX. So, Breakpoint once again comes through for us and we have an EX out of it. It seems to be Breakpoint because the last couple times that I've done openings, I've gotten full art Gyaradoses from this set. Now I got a Ho Ho EX, which is a normal type. That's pretty cool. So, its ability is Purifying Fire. So, once during your turn, before you attack, if this card has any basic fire energy attached to it, you may heal 50, uh, 50 damage from it. That's kind of cool, which is interesting because then the Elemental Feather. So you have to have Grass, Water, and Electric. So this is a very diverse deck that you could run this in. I mean, you, uh, I don't know, it'd be kind of tough. So you'd have to have four types of energy in here to even, to you make full use of this card. It's kind of tough. So, but this attack does 30 damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. So 130 damage, that's, that's pretty good. If you can make it work, it'd be pretty decent, not gonna lie. So that's pretty cool. But well, we did get a Ho Ho EX, so once again, Breakpoint has come through, as always. But, last pack of Fates Collide, hopefully, I really want something out of this set. I just, I have not had good luck with this set so far. So look, that one was, so I, Breakpoint, Breakpoint apparently has the code cards the way I think they are, and then the, all the other sets do not. I don't really understand that. So, first off, we have... Bent Spoon, Dugon, Energy Pouch, Bronzon, Larvitar, Burmy, Seal, Fennekin. Ooh, the reverse in the is a Chaos Tower. That's pretty cool. That's that's a cool reverse. And the rare in the pack is a Zygarde. Ironic. Kinda of funny. And actually, oh well, hey, look at that. That's interesting so the rare in the pack so this, these are the same card in gen like basically so it's the same attacks just different art and this one's a hollow and this one's not that's pretty cool so basically we got a worse version of the promo card in that one so oh, whatever I mean it's not a terror I mean it's actually it's not a great card either not gonna lie but I mean in all honesty we at least we did get one EX out of this set which is cool which I mean the ho-ho I'm, I'm happy about I mean it's cool I mean I don't know how useful it is competitively but it's a cool card. I mean, I always love EXs. I just love the art on EXs. They're always just so cool. I wish it was a full... I don't know if there's a full art of this, but that'd be awesome to pull. But so be it. That's cool. But <laughs> I'm going to go over to the other camera and close this video out. All right, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that uh, Zygarde collection opening. I, I know, I've been enjoying doing the TC on the... I've been enjoying doing the TCG on the channel. But I hope you guys have too. Leave a thumbs up down below if you have. Thumbs down if you aren't. Uh, subscribe to the channel for more TCG Pokemon news. I know tomorrow, today, this is uploading on July 31st. Tomorrow, August 1st, is supposed to be a announcement for Sun and Moon. And I made a video on the channel. If you haven't checked that out, if, you have, if it isn't August 1st yet, or if it is, I should have tomorrow. I will be doing an update on Sun and Moon because I made a video talking about Comic-Con. Who I, I talked to one of the, actually, ran, I actually talked to somebody who worked on the game at Comic-Con at the Nintendo thing. And that basically that the uh, second evolutions of the starters are coming. Watch that video if you haven't checked it out yet on the channel. But tomorrow, August 1st, I will be doing an update. So look forward to that. All right, guys. But I'm going to get out of here. Before I do, i got to remind you to stay lucky.